Hey guys, welcome back to 2G Hydroponics. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I started my lettuce seeds for my new Kratky hydroponic setup. Okay, so what we started with here are four different types of lettuce. Some I started directly in the Rockwell cubes, and some seeds I put directly into water. It's been six days. Let's see how they both look. Okay, so this is what it looks like after six days. In the Rockwell cubes, uh, I did plant two seeds per cube. This is the first time I'm doing it, so I wasn't sure how they would germinate. Some, as you can see, didn't come up at all, but most came up, and several of them even have two seeds going. Now, let's see if we have any roots. All right, so there you have it. Already getting through the Rockwell cube with the roots. So pretty soon that'll be ready to go into my tote. Okay, so as you can see, I got some seeds started in the water here. I put these in the same day that I had started my seeds in the Rockwell cubes. And you'll see the Rockwell cubes in the water here. I just put them in today as a bit of a pre-soak because I will be transplanting these seeds into the Rockwell today. So let's just take a little closer look. So again, this is six days. I'm going to try and pick it up here. So that's how it looks. They're quite a bit smaller than the ones I have in the cubes right now. But we're going to go ahead and transplant them. Let's just take a look first before we do that at the pH. That's why I put the Rockwell cubes right in the water with the seeds. Just to see, put them in the, uh, have them in the same environment, in the same pH, in the same water. So you can see that's really high. 8.37, really high compared to what I've heard you should have. But as you can see, the seeds have germinated. Okay, I also started some cubes in this bowl, and I did lower the pH on this as an experiment. Let's see what this turned out to. So really low sevens, just a little bit over seven. So once we put this, the uh, small seeds in there, we'll see if it really makes any difference. Okay, so how I'm gonna do it is I'm just gonna cut down the cube. Open it up. Let's see if we can get one of these guys in there. Okay. So I put them down there fairly low. I think that's it. I'll try and close that up a little bit. Okay, that's one. And now this is from my pH water. Okay, so all the new seedlings are put in the cubes. These were the seeds that were put right in the water. Now you can see the difference, quite a big difference between six days from the seeds being right in the Rockwell cubes to seeds that were put directly in water. Anyway, we're gonna put them back under the light and on the grow mat, and over the next few days, we'll see how they do. Okay, so like I said, that's been six days that uh, they've been in the Rockwell cubes. I figure maybe another six more, seven more, somewhere around two weeks, they'll be ready for the totes. So if you like this video, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, 
and I'll see you next time.